Hi all, welcome to Salesforce in 5 minutes. In this video, we are going to understand how to retrieve particular components from our Salesforce awk to our personal computer using Workbench. But before getting started, if you really like my videos, I request you to please subscribe to this channel. So right now we are working on the deployment process. So in deployment, usually there is a source org and there is a, is a destination org, right? And as we are going to use Workbench, we need a middleware. As I've already told you, we need a middleware. And right now I'm going to use my own personal computer or personal laptop as a middleware. So first from the source org, if I want to deploy the components to the dev, dev uh, dip, uh, the destination org, first I need to get the retrieve from the source org inside my personal computer. Retrieve means basically all the information that is necessary, like all the name of the components, the functions and the filters and everything, every data of the component, I have to first retrieve from the source or to the destination to our personal computer. Okay, so that's what we are going to do in this video. <clears throat> to do that first, right now I'm inside the Apex. Uh, this is this is my source org. Okay, that is Salesforce in five minutes or this is going to be my source org. So if I go to the account object, I have one page layout okay extra page layout named as custom page layout okay i have one newly created page layout which is i am going to deploy to another page also along with that i have a custom field okay field named as custom field on the account that's what also i'm going to deploy another thing that we have is uh, there's an object named as company object which is a custom object okay this is also we are going to deploy along with that we are going to deploy a flow let's uh, deploy yeah this flow let's deploy this flow okay this is created by me so what we are going to learn in this video mostly how to deploy objects okay custom objects okay and next i think so is page layouts okay fields and automation tools that is flows process builder and everything like that okay so that's what we are going to deploy from our uh, that's what we are going to retrieve first of all okay the first step is retrieve to our personal computer so as we have already learned what's package.xml is, is first of all what components exactly do i want okay that's what i need to specify inside the package.xml in order to retrieve so first i need a custom object that is the uh, company object that we had okay so for that purpose i have this package.xml already created i'm going to further configure it in order to specify the names of the components that i want to retrieve so first let's write type types slash types and inside this types we need to specify what type of the component we want to retrieve like name we want to retrieve a custom object right so it's going to be custom object and we are going to close this name tag and out of this custom object what exactly do we want to retrieve so we have to specify the members okay slash m m e m b e r s okay let's go and what is the object name company okay that's what we need to retrieve so i'm going to specify the object name that i need to retrieve next what i want is i also want to retrieve the field right on account custom objects and there is a custom field on the account object so now in order to do that first i need to go to the account and there's a field named as custom field available on the account right now if i want to retrieve a custom field i need to specify first of all of which object this field is then dot the field name and instead of custom object i'm going to write custom field okay so this is the retrieve or this is the package.xml for custom field the same way i want to also get the page layout from this particular account right so in order to get the layout in uh, first of all we will type the type as layout okay the name as layout and out of the account we want the layout right so from the account uh, object i want the layout that is named as custom page layout so i want to do that so i'm going to copy paste the name of this custom page layout now once i've done the first thing that I have to do is I have to specify of which object do I want to retrieve the layout of. Next, the keep uh, type dash and then specify the name of the custom page layout or the layout that you want. Okay. Again, last thing that I want is I want to retrieve the <coughs> flows as well, right? So for that purpose, I need to go to the flows. 
ओके अवर फ्लोज नेम बस कस्टम चाइल्ड टू पेरेंट फ्लो गो टू दिस फ्लो एंड कॉपी पेज द नेम ऑफ दिस फ्लो ओके दैट इज द ए पी आई नेम पेज दिस नेम ऑफ द फ्लो एंड इंस्टेड ऑफ ले आउट वी आर गोइंग टू गिव फ्लोज और नेम इज फ्लो ओके सो राइट ना इफ यू चेक आउट द पैकेज एक्स एम एल वी हैव द कस्टम ऑब्जेक्ट वी हैव द कस्टम फील्ड ऑफ अकाउंट ऑब्जेक्ट नेक्स्ट वी हैव द ले आउट ऑफ द अकाउंट ऑब्जेक्ट नेक्स्ट वी हैव अ फ्लो राइट सो वी हैव स्पेसिफाइड ऑल द थिंग्स दैट आई वॉन्ट टू रिट्रीव फ्रॉम द सोर्स ऑर्क इन साइड द पैकेज ऑट एक्स एम एल नेक्स्ट थिंग आई वॉन्ट टू एक्चुअली रिट्रीव इट राइट आई हैव स्पेसिफाइड वॉट आई वॉन्ट टू रिट्रीव बट हाउ डू आई रिट्रीव इट सो फॉर दैट पर्पज फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल गो टू द वर्क बेंच Now, if you, I will always suggest this. Just go to the website and just check whether you are on the correct uh, website or correct uh, UI or not. Okay, this is the first thing. Next, I want to do is I need to retrieve, right? So go to the migration and click on retrieve. And inside the unpackage manifest, select select your uh, package dot XML. So in my case, Salesforce in five minutes. This was the package dot XML that I created just now. Use it. and click on next again click on retrieve okay so if you count it out whether your retrieve was correct or not if you see there are 1 2 3 and 4 there are four things let's click on it okay i have five things that is first is the account object right that has been retrieved company object that has been retrieved the page layout of the account and along with that i have the flow of this uh, flow that i want to retrieve along with that i have a package dot xml also retrieved so once i click on download zip i'll click on retrieve extract here and let's click on unpackage so here you can see everything has been retrieved right you can see that the child to parent flow everything the get contacts the 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 get contacts has been retrieved the filters has been retrieved every detail has been retrieved from right and if i go to again back to the unpackaged we can see the layouts layouts has also been retrieved the objects has also been retrieved account and uh, the company object right if i go to over here it see it shows that the custom field has been retrieved so this is how you retrieved uh, whatever components that you want from the source work now in the next video we will understand how to take this retrieve and deploy it to our destination or that whatever we need and the components will be created if you found this video helpful i request you to please subscribe to this channel